and let you know why we here, because Jake will get emotional, but niggas like that is the reason we here, man. Because a nigga like that will never acknowledge his sin, huh? ever. You can almost miracles and still talk shit and question how are you, how about shit out shot? Man. They never truly. That's insane, bro. That's insane. He says, though briars and thorns be with thee, and though doing style salaki, and though dwell among scorpions, be not afraid of their words, nor be dismayed at their looks. Hey, that's what it's like dealing with Jake, man. When you in like the bushes and there's thorns and shit, you gotta be real careful around Jake. Then it says scorpions. You don't even want to take a scorpion in your hand and you know it's gonna strike you. Yep. That's a nigga, man. Yeah. You know? So the Lord's like, don't you be amongst niggas like that, man. Hey, don't be afraid of them. Right? Yeah. Though they be a rebellious house. Yeah, that, that nigga was rebellious, man. This is what I got the whole knowledge of what you telling me. Nigga could have read the scriptures from front to back, which most niggas say that. But you read it with no understanding. You read it without teachers. You read it without uh, uh, the faith. You read it without the spirit of Yahweh Shemesh. That's why you don't know nothing. And though, and thou shalt speak my words unto them, whether they will hear or whether they will forbear. You thinking that since he ran away, like see, see they ain't got nobody listening to them, so they knew. Not knowing that we got the, the cloud of witnesses right here, man. See, Jake is, is dumb as hell. It's about the elect. And that's what uh, a lot of these camps is mad at Great Millstone about. We go into the elect, the elect, only the elect, man. The hell with the rest of the nation. The nation has got the warning, but the elect has to get the seal on them. And once they get sealed, it's over, man. Then the end shall come. When this gospel, this gospel is preached throughout the whole world, then the end shall come, man. For they are most rebellious. They're most rebellious. So let a nigga rebel. Hey, you should have just told him, hey, look at the, the Haitians on the border. Look at Issachar. Look at the rest of our people that's without the Heavenly Father and His Son. They're through. They're done. The Lord have given them over into the hand of Satan. Ask, ask the dude who got the, uh, the vaccine and the faith left. Yep. Come on, man. Don't play with the Heavenly Father. He'll, he'll fuck. Yeah, the faith snatchers out here, man. Yep. Man, is that it? Is some fatality for your ass. Go ahead. Take it from This is a... Uh, Says, cry aloud, spare not. Lift up thy voice as like a trumpet. Now Why we're, blow, we're blowing the trumpet, which uh, the, uh, the feast of ta uh, not tabernacles, but the blowing of the trumpet represents the preaching of the gospel now. And that's what that's what uh, makes Jake mad. Like the same Jake in the ancient world, the trumpet is being blown for. But that's why the Lord warned against Jake settled on their leaves. Like what the fuck y'all thought this was? Day of the Lord is gonna be darkness, wrath, trouble. Didn't the Lord say prepare for the day of battle? Yeah. So come on, man. Jake think it's a time to party. No, the trumpet is being blown to get the, your armor on. You, but Jake, uh, man, I ain't wanna go fight right now. That's why the Lord said, cursed is the man that keeping this sword back from blood. Why you niggas rather not fight? You rather just fucking give in. Yep. But the Lord has raised up men to fight, just like the Maccabees. A lot of you niggas is like our people who sold out to the Greeks, man. You just want to be okay. You have license to sin. Uh, see, I got a license that I can do whatever. But the Lord's still going to judge your ass for what you're doing. Yep. And we, we're here to let you know. If you don't repent, you're going to die. The Lord's going to hold you guilty of all your sins. Hey, so like, yeah, sometimes with a battlefield, you, you have to let out a cry. You know, you have to get yeah, loud. You know right. what I'm saying? Like, He's there, you yelling. I'm you know saying, on the, on the battlefield. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. You, you yeah, yelling, yeah. You don't hear man. noise. Yeah. <laughs> He's just quietly. Hey, he'll say that. Quiet battle and shit. That's it. That's all you hear in this shit. That's the same thing. That's the same thing. That's the same thing. That's the same thing. Yeah. You know he was a game nigga, man. Go ahead. I this is uh, Isaiah 58 and yeah. 1. It's quiet loud. Spare not. Lift up my voice like a trumpet. And show my people their transgressions in the house of Jacob their sins. So he's showing Jake that his knowledge wasn't shit. If it ain't coming from the book, and that's when he got mad when he pointed at it. Because he, uh, he, he, like, he, he didn't have no he didn't have no scriptures to bring out. He know that everything we're doing is coming out of the books. He coming out of his emotions. So 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 he got hurt. He got offended. That's the first thing he said. It uh, rewritten. So he was already denying this. He hated you know? the word. I was rewritten. Yeah. And niggas can't prove that statement. Right. Translate hey, who they learn it from? I, the goddamn devil, man. Esau, Edom. 
and a stupid ass nigga that was listening to Esau either. So you see, it was be written in King James. You know, he was a, like not even researching nothing, right. not knowing about the man, his lineage, nothing. You just hearsay. Right. That's and what a nigga. Is yeah, about. he talking about the scriptures being translated or rewritten, whatever he talking about. But that same nigga will go read a book on Egyptology that's in English and, <laughs> and say that this is the truth. Written by a so-called white man. That's why I mentioned uh, a math problem. I'm like, if I tell you to write down the math problem, you are not rewriting the math problem. You just writing it down for yourself to solve the same problem that I'm trying to solve. Same with the scriptures. It's the same word that was written down in scrolls in the Hebrew, translated into the Greek, then translated into English and all these other languages. But it's the same word that was written. That's right. But it's just in the language that you can understand it in. It said that with stammering lips in another tongue shall I speak unto this people. So Lord said that we're going to speak unto your ass, man. Jake don't know he's being recorded. He got an angel up there like, yeah, yeah. 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 He was scoffing. <laughs> 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 Whatever, brother, go ahead. This is Proverbs chapter 13, verse 13. Oh, man. It reads, Whoso despises the word shall be destroyed. Hey, look at my man polite. He despised. You know, you know he went. That that the law was in place for his weekend. Well, he was still been put down though. Because what he did was awful. But but niggas, man, when Jacob's trouble come, they gonna wish that they had turned unto the heavenly father. Because they gonna know, it tells you in Deuteronomy, that our people gonna say in their mind, and not all these evils come upon us because our God is not among us. They gonna say that. The Lord promised them that day. You gonna say this, watch. You gonna, you gonna call upon me in the day of your calamity. And you gonna want me to help you. And I'm not gonna help you. <laughs> but he that feareth the commandment shall be rewarded. But he that feareth the commandment shall be rewarded. Man. See, Jake is stupid as hell, man. Nigga probably got the Maxine or gonna go, go get the Maxine and shit. This was your last hope. This is the last, this is the last uh, uh, defense against yeah. the onslaught of this devil. Yeah. And once this word is gone and this devil has complete control, then Jake, you in trouble, man. When, we, when we're deemed uh, uh, treasonous, terrorists for speaking out, then Jake, you're gonna be in trouble. Because even Jake said that this is the last place of freedom to speak your mind or whatever. Even that's being exactly. You can't. You got to use certain buzzwords and not get dinged on you. Exactly. You know? Yeah. you know. They don't know how dangerous a time we are living in. But go ahead. I... This Matthew twelve and thirty four. Man. Old generations of vipers. Old generation of vipers. This is a generation of vipers. The same generation that hated Yahweh Shai is the same generation that's back right or in now. modern day terms, a generation of niggas. Man. <laughs> Niggas, man. Niggas. Oh, oh, that's what it's talking about. Yeah, old gen yeah, generation. <laughs> yeah, yeah. He said, old generation, uh, uh, this is a faithless generation. But yet, the same generation that's going to hold faith for a treasure is in this generation. How can ye being evil speak good things? Bad dude, how the fuck you being evil as fuck, nigga? You probably killed your own brother many a time. You up here fucking talking to us as if we off. As if we wrong. Now, but who law is it though? But you keep the fucking white man's law, so called. But you don't keep the law of because he's like, you law? What law? And I told him this law came from heaven. Okay. okay. This nigga forgot that that Moses received it from heaven. He didn't just go up there and write it himself. He received it from somewhere. From the heavens, man. And it's gonna be placed in us in the kingdom, man. For all time. The nigga gonna be happy to be under that law. He's polite. He's gonna be happy to be under that law, man. Your brother's so real good uh, temperance. Really, the Lord is exercising it. Huh. So really, you know, the true nature of a man, and the nigga get crazy like that, you just wanna knock his yeah, off yeah, and yeah. down his throat. Like, it's not in the nature of a man to argue yeah, and go back right, and forth and right. talk louder, but hey, we, we rule in our spirits. Because yep. it, it's spiritual first. Yep. That's right. Beautiful. Close, on the yeah. 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 Yeah.
Okay, right. so I mean, hey, you're you gonna get some catfish every now and then, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. But 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 we're gonna weed out, you know, through the spirit of power, y'all by Shimmer Shai, those that are meant to get this. Hey, the so, world weeded his ass out, man, and made him reveal himself. That's right. You know, a damn snake in the grass. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, yeah, probably got a council in heaven because you got a chariot up there with a spiritual scope on his ass, man. Uh -huh. You know, right when he left, the chariot popped up. Yep. So he's probably going to die tonight. Yep. Hey, that's the spirit. <laughs> hey, that's the spirit. Hey, the Lord going to put in his mind to get the vaccine or whatever else is waiting for his ass, man. Because we did mention the concentration camp. That was, that's what got Jake heated. Like, hey, fuck our people, man, right now. We only here for the elect of our people. Peace and blessing upon the Israel of God. That's right. And, and to hell with the rest of you niggas, man. That's why I ain't feeling sad for uh, Levi on the, on the border, man. A lot of y'all is wicked as hell. Brought your ass up from Haiti doing voodoo and shit. Lord, whooping your ass now. Y'all the priestly tribe, man. Hoya, join on the meat. You know what I'm saying? Y'all out there doing oh, wickedness. Hey, now I oh, be joined on the eat. Join on the meat. Hey, Check that out. <laughs> hey, now, now, now the, Lord, the Lord was that dude on horseback grabbing like, like, man, he dead. The Lord is just beginning. It's the beginning of sorrow, man. Yep. Expect more crying, man. Expect more sorrow. Expect, expect more evil. Yeah, right. For out of the abundance of the heart, the mouth speaketh. So out of his, his mind, he spoke what he believed. Oh, so, oh, that was rewritten and all that. Well, you're right, dumbass. We had a nation of scribes that always rewrite more copies than what we needed. And I believe Ezra had to write down uh, the whole history, the, the books of Moses and all that. He had to rewrite it. Because when the Babylonians came in there, they sacked everything, burned relics so the lord put it on the spirit to write everything down again you know yeah, same but, with most but our enemies know the history too man and they have it written down because right. in order to tell a lie you need to know the truth yep. you know what i'm saying and the scriptures even say like i said man we go to the scriptures for all things the scriptures say we will come to the one of our enemies for all things man. you know so we we had to come to esau to learn certain things but the spirit is the one that that's dealing with us man. Right. you know the lord set everything up and he made it he made the writing on the wall just like in the time of uh, Daniel and uh, Belshazzar. Nobody else can read that in scripture but Daniel. Same with the scriptures, it's always been, right? right. Man, like, who can interpret this? And then the men of the Lord rose up to interpret it for him. But a nigga don't want to listen to what the men of the Lord got to say, which this is how we know that we have to be the men of the Lord. And these is the, the people of Israel. Because it said, Old oh, Jerusalem, thou that killest the prophets that are sent unto you, man. He wish he could kill us, right. but he can't. Yep. Is we in a whole another time for right now. A good man out of the good treasure of the heart bringeth forth good things. So these brothers are good men, man. We're not good because of our works or anything we done. We're good because the Lord is, is dealing with us, man. He said, like, well, you're good enough for me to deal with you. I'm going to give you my word and put it in your mouth. Just like Moses. He told the Lord, I can't speak. I'm not, I'm not eloquent. The Lord said, I'm going to put the words, my words in your mouth to speak. Because brothers was never like this in public speaking and all that. Oh, hell, oh, hell, no, man. Oh, hell. Lord put it in my spirit to, hell, no. to stand bold against a nigga in the world. You like, you got it, man. You got it. Right. Is, is there a problem with some, uh, you know, some boys in the hood? See, this is why dudes get smoked every night. Trying to move out hard they is. The other day, nigga got a problem. What's good? You gonna make me shit on nigga out man. See, Jake is out here like that. For us, like, bro, we ain't got to lift up no hands. The angels are watching. The angels, man. They watching your ass. Y'all about to watch your ass watching. And a nigga like that, man, let's just say, like, we was on a carnal tip. You would have been through somewhere back there. Oh, All man. that yelling and yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that's wasting hey, your energy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. brother would have quickly just, you know, really got, it, got in there close. Got in there close with his ass. Dead legs is out. Bop. No words spoken. He wouldn't have got close. You got Zion over there. You got a hand oh, yeah. like yeah. Sonic the Hedgehog. Oh, yeah. He wouldn't even got up hey, there. And he's stupid as hell because he entered into the den of lions. Yeah, like, bro, how you coming at us, but you forget your ass is around here. Yeah, he was carnal, you know what I'm saying? Hey. Oh, and that was a straight 300 move. He came into the, into the palace. I, now he just got to close his ass in. See, Jay going Look at his surroundings, he ain't circumspect. Right. Like, bro, there's a lot more men here than you, bro. And you think you don't care what the fuck we know, you don't know who we about. You don't even know where we came from. And you want that's how you know a demon was on it. And you don't know what kind of week we had during the week, man. Yeah. Right. You know, because we go through shit every week, bro. Every fucking week we go through shit, bro. Right. We prayed, 
to get out every week out here and we paying the left we we're speaking to you about the Lord, man, how great the Lord is through our troubles, man. That's right. He needs to be feared, man. Right. And can a brother get that reverence as 